Hey YouTube, it's YouTube OJ. Like I said before, um, I'll be doing a, a deck profile of that Battle Pack Draft Tournament deck I used. It did okay, but I, it was single uh, elimination, so I lost during the second round. But yeah. So, what gets to the side deck? The side deck, um, there's only four cards, and that's Intrigue Shield, Two on a Sable Evolution, and Fly on Ohm. I got kind of stuck with this card, and I'm like, oh crap, this ain't going to be any good. But then I realized, like, uh, I could have used it. <laughs> you guys will see why soon. The only extra deck card is Ghost Trick Owl card. Um, I picked it up because, well, I, this came in my first pack, and it's a Shadow Foil, first set, always your first set, and people like, and this guy sitting next to me, he's like, dude, get that owl card, I'm like, okay, <laughs> and it turns out it's like 10 bucks or something for this owl card, so, uh, um, and now let's get to the actual deck, here we go. No, I was trying to make like a control kind of deck. Now you guys can see like a theme of this, but yeah, I'm not quite sure what was what kind of deck it was going to be. I was going to try to make a control kind of deck, but yeah. But then, yeah, a lot of us got stuck with some cards that weren't very good, so we're pretty forced to use them. So free go gone and golem. This card's pretty good. Um, it's destroyed by battle. Your opponent's monster becomes zero, and you can banish this card from your grave and target one spell trap and destroy it. And your opponent cannot activate any cards in response. One claw can be your drago. Pretty good card. Engages um, your opponent can spell some light or dark monsters. And claw can be your doom. Pretty much the same thing. These guys are pretty good beaters. Evil Hero and Friendly Gainer. The only reason I chose this card and to be my deck is because um, you could banish one monster, you could control, target, you know. You can banish this card and you can target one monster you control and then it gets um, attacked twice in one turn. Um, and during your second standby phase, after this card effect was activated, special from this card, um, special from this card from the banish zone. And now, in Battle Pack Draft, all monsters are treated at the same type. So it says Fiend, you can use any monster to to target. So yeah. Card Trooper. Freya. Now Freya's in here because all monsters you control gain 400 attack and defense. So that I thought opened pretty good and to give all my monsters an attack boost. Chiron and Mage basically like a breaker. Goblin a light attack wars, big big attackers. Uh, Fabled Ashen Veil, pretty good card. Redora, this card will been this card actually won me a game because it gains two hundred attack of each fairy type monster in your grave. But since in battle back draft all monsters are treated as the same type. It gains two hundred of each monster in your graveyard. <laughs> um so yeah. Free boss. Or uh, Mechoid Army of Grinnell, basically a Black Wing Gale to wear one. When it's normal zoning, target one face up monster point controls, half that target's attack till the end phase. Line up Juggler, pretty good. Gauntlet Warrior, I, I kind of got stuck with, I got, I got stuck with this card. Uh, Gentle Mander, I did choose this card as a tech actually. I thought it open, I get good card because it's basically like a battle fader. When your opponent's monster requires an attack, either it's attacking your monster or you. If you spell some discard from your hand, your opponent cannot, uh, cannot attack any monsters except this one. So it's pretty good. Uh, Jane, I got stuck with Jane actually in my crap. <laughs> See, Koala, I actually thought this would be a good card. Um, it's once per turn, you target one monster, your opponent controls, change its attack to zero. And so at the end of this turn, you must control a beast type monster other than this card to activate and solve this effect. So, you know, so the same thing. Parallel to Purple Light and Gate Traps. Hybrid Hammerhead, if 
a monster isn't destroyed by battle of discard, then that monster is um, re returned to the owner's hand. So basically, if your opponent has like a big beater out, uh, it's like a higher level, you could just attack with this, take a couple damage, and then return it to the field. I actually did use this against Quantum Cat, so yeah, you had to use it again. Stego Cyber, um, pretty good card, not too bad. Very big defender, um, pretty much all to say about him. For spells, two card defense. Yeah, and I don't really have too much high levels pulled. I'm like, wow. Uh, yeah, Stego Cyber is like the only highest level monster I pulled, actually. It's pretty weird. Um, yeah, two card advantage, space you just to look at the top cards of your deck and then place them in any order. Two ribbon rebirths. See, this is the reason I try to do a control kind of deck. Because during the F phase, if the equip monster was destroyed by battle ends in the grave, this turns best of summon it in a grave to your side of the field. So I use this against my opponent. And when I destroyed this monster, it came to my field. So, yeah, it was pretty good. Now, premature burial, because there's no banalist. Market of Rose, because all monsters treat as all types. Sword can steal the light, enemy control, creature swap, and spell look of wisdom. And finally, for the traps, Quantum Cat, on Breakable Spirit, Ghost from the Past, Swap Mirror. The only brand of these cards was amazing. Dark Bribe. No entry, kunai with chain and hate buster. So you basically see a like, control kind of theme in this deck, kind of. Well, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was the deck I used for Battle Pack Free Draft Tournament. Uh, it did pretty good. Like I said, it was a single elimination. So if you lost a match, you, you're out. Uh, but I won the first round and then I lost the second. But yeah, guys, that was, that was pretty fun. Uh, I wasn't really in it to win. I was just in it for the fun of it. Um, let me see what I could pull. <laughs> but yeah. And the judge wouldn't allow us to use cameras in order to see, so in order to put it on YouTube, like what we pull and all that. We wouldn't allow it. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe. And as you say, do us, Jay. Sign out. Peace, guys.